uh, welcome to my new course it's called digital electronics where i've covered all the topics most of the topics in depth uh, the topics are as follows the first topic will be logic gates where i have started with and gates or gates not gates and then uh, finally jumping into universal gates and how to design those basic gates using universal gates and some properties about these gates also so this will cover the section one then i move towards binary arithmetic and its uh, uh, reduction techniques or you can say binary algebra so binary algebra where you will do all the calculations using laws de morgan laws uh, consensus laws different type of laws you will have in uh, boolean algebra and it's a reduction technique where you will be studying about k maps which is a much more efficient way to uh, make make a logical expression and uh, hence design a uh, design the circuit using and or or not gates then i move towards the uh, number system which is binary arithmetic topic uh, in number system i will be dealing with uh, uh, all the type of um, bases you can think of like uh, arithmetic uh, uh, bases are there no decimal base system or um, octal number system hexadecimal number system binary number system these number systems i will deal in uh, depth and i'll show you the conversions between them i'll show you the uh, the arithmetic between them how you can do addition subtraction division multiplication in each of these number systems so uh, slightly easier but uh, still important topic for uh, i think then i move towards uh, the biggest topics uh, that is combinational circuits and sequential circuits in combinational circuits you will see all the type of uh, circuit you can think of uh, using multiplexers encoders decoders full adder half adder full subtractor half subtractor code convert converters means whatever codes you will study in uh, like B C D to gray, gray to B C D, access three types. All these conversions you will have in in uh, a combinational circuits. It's a long topic. Then uh, coming to the sequential circuit. Next topic will be the sequential circuit. Before that, I have uh, dealt with uh, flip flops, latches, and then resistors. Uh, you will see counters. These are individual topics which I have covered in flip flops and resistors uh, section. And then moving towards the sequential circuit. In the sequential circuit, you will get the FSM designs, sequence generator, sequence uh, detector. These all topics I have covered in in the sequential circuit. If you have uh, some some random or arbitrary question, then how you gonna frame towards sequential circuit? This is the most important uh, section I would say, uh, which will give a much more practical vibe to you. Then moving to the extra curricular type of topics which is which are programmable logic devices that i have dealt after this uh, where you will study about prom uh, pal uh, plas okay so these are kind of extending but still you should be having some idea about this which will be very helpful so designing those combinational circuits using pld's you will uh, learn basically here then moving towards the analog to digital conversion part where i have uh, separately dealt with analog to digital conversion as well as digital to analog converter so there you will see a dual slope type of analog to digital converter or you will see counter type or r to 2r dac to uh, inverted r to 2r these type of topics you will see there so this will be filled with analog to digital conversion uh, some sample and hold circuits also i have taken in the in the last uh, which you will enjoy and then jumping towards the logic families which is again a big topic uh, mostly people don't deal with it but it is i've dealt in 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 a very detail uh, you will see uh, i square l totem pole ttl type ecl type mosfet family bjt family all families i have covered then finally i slightly touched upon the semiconductor memories i have just given the top overview type so that you will get how what things you can imagine in digital vlsi side and after that you can go towards digital vlsi or uh, fpga side so i have left in that in that zone uh, this course so that you will be able to get a basic feeling as well as you can move towards the advanced courses as well so this is the in uh, means course structure you will get in this course and i have uh, almost uh, four to five hundred four four thirty or four forty videos i have shot and oh, total content would be around uh, of uh, 72 to 70 plus hours uh, you will genuinely enjoy it i have uh, 
put lot of time on this course um, it's must one of the my longest course to be to be frank so you will definitely enjoy it and uh, i've taught in in the simplest manner possible so uh, do check it out and uh, hopefully i'll you will enjoy it and uh, see you guys in the next or the first lecture